Hey, it's Jessica, aka Bronze Girl 89. Today I am doing one of Jennifer Lopez makeup look for her new video, I Love You Bobby. So in her video, she has her signature uh, messy bun and pink lips and a smoky eye. In this in this tutorial, I have used a few products. You will see me switching back and forth. And oh, excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Ooh. All right. <laughs> Sorry. So this is my version of her look in the video. And um, if you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button, you know? Give me a thumbs up, too. And if you want to see uh, a tutorial on this messy bun, leave a comment down below to... Uh, leave a comment down below say messy bun tutorial, and I will post one up. So let's get to the video. Bye. So you want to gather all your hair and put it in a high ponytail. Don't mind the faces that I'm making while I'm doing this. Next, you want to grab any hair tie, don't matter what color, because it's going to be covered by your hair anyway. So, next, you want to section your ponytail to three parts like you're about to braid, but you're not. So, twist every section of your hair and wrap it around your ponytail. Like I'm doing right here. Then you wanna grab some bobby pins and pin that down. Continue to do it to the rest of the sections. section twist twist it around the ponytail and pin it down again make sure to pin down any loose hairs and also hairspray your flyaways and brush it down with a soft brush Next, I will be using my Too Faced Shadow Insurance and I'll be priming my upper and bottom lids. Next, I'll be taking my Maybelline Tattoo, barely bronze and I'll be putting it on my eyelid and I'm using it as a base oh and don't forget to do it in the corners next I'll be taking my chocolate bar and I will be using that light brown on the top row Put it in my crease. Next, I'll be taking that brick color at the bottom row, and I will do my outer outer lid. So back to this brownish brown, I'm just going to go do my outer corners again and blend it out with the same brush. to 
you get the two colors blended together real well. Next, I'm just going to take a small brush and put it on my bottom. Again, with that brown on the top row, the outer corners is the same way I did with the red, brick red. Here I'm just taking a regular eyeliner and doing my bottom and upper waterline. Don't forget to do the tear duct. I was going to use the eyeliner pencil, but I decided to use liquid eyeliner to do a small, well, not a small, thin line above my eyelashes. So when I put my lashes on, you don't see where my real eyelashes and the fake eyelashes begin, so. And don't forget to put mascara on. Here I'm using the Ardell lashes in 18 and do a lash glue in a dark tone and wait a few seconds before applying And I'm going to use my cur eyelash curler to curl my lashes so my real lashes blend with the falsies. And apply mascara again. Next I'll be taking that same brow and putting it on my eyebrows. face primer it fills in your pores if you have any big pores it works wonderful here I'm taking a damp beauty blender and I sprayed it with some NYX matte finishing spray and I'm just putting my BB cream all over my face and actually this is my first time using this beauty blender and I actually like it Conceal your bags or what you want to call dark circles. Make it with a damp beauty blender, blend it out. Next is my NYC loose face powder in the color translucent. And I'm just setting the concealer because concealer can do crease. Next, I'm going to do a little bronzing, but it's not going to Next, I'm just going to blend my Now, that, in case you don't know what that is, that is the Benefit Watts Up Highlighter. So, I just put on my cheek, my chin, and the bridge of my nose. watching this is my look i hope you like bye
Thank mm-hmm. you.